So this is Garner State Park. Great place to go camping. Now we are here at this RV park here. We are here, the Freer River. We were just at the Freer River. You see the videos here. And you can swim, bring a tube. And these are 30 and 50 amp. And the best ones to stay at the Frio are along the sides. Actually, all these are nice. The problem with these is they're slanted towards the river. So you have to level the Live Oak up top is really nice, but the uh, Persimmon Hill is is uh, dry camp, so they have just water for tents. Also went down to this this area here, which is okay, it's nice, uh, not too bad, but I actually like this area the best because it's more secluded. A lot of traffic down there, paddle boats down here and other things, camp store, visitors there. And then you have all these hiking trails, which I didn't do. Um, there's also the river camping, the river crossing area. Uh, we've been there, it's, it's okay. Uh, like I said, I actually prefer the, um, this area here. So if you do come, the Freer River camping area is probably the better ones to get along with Live Oak. Live Oak is really nice. This one here, I just found that there was a lot of traffic. A lot of traffic. And um, that's where a lot of the day campers go as well. The only problem with the um, Freer River is if you park along this side here, uh, you will have people going by the side of your camp to the Freer River, so it's something to consider. So probably the best one to consider would be here in the middle. These are all nice spots. All back in. I think the only ones that have pool in are these ones here in this area here. This is what they look like before. Like I said, the 30 and 50 amp, even back in. The only problem with mine that was an issue was my camp table was really far away. So make sure you look online to see where your camp table is. Mine is unusable because it's about 100, 200 feet away. But everything else is accessible. Nice day, you can go for a walk, and the kids can go running. And there's not too many Karens out here telling you to slow down and do whatever. Loud music, which I like, there's no loud music. It's beautiful, it's quiet. We did have a rain come in here last night at two in the morning, so make sure you bring a power strip with a surge, excuse me, for your RV. And, uh, Hope you enjoy. But this is definitely a must come back to place. Oh yeah, and there is absolutely no cell phone coverage here. I have to go to the visitor center and use the Wi-Fi. Or I go into town and I go we go to eat in one of the towns in Lake Key or in Las Maples Cafe up there in Utopia. And you can use their Wi-Fi. All right, that's all. Hope you enjoy this video.